very good morning to all my lovely students of Ganga International School, Samta. Today, I'm here again to give you English class. In our previous class, we have done these phonic sounds. That is, e, e. Everyone have to speak with me. E, b, b, k. This is k. Everyone, speak with me. K. D, D, E, E, F, F. If you remember, we have done F for frog, fish, right? Now we are switching over to the next phonic sound that is called G. This is G. G says grapes. G grapes. G. Grass, g grass, g for girl, the gorgeous girl, right? G girl, g glass, g glass, and g for gog. It's a basically sunglasses. When you go out under the sun, you have to wear this. These are the goggles, right? Goggle. This is goggle, and this is. Every child's favorite is gift. G for gift. When it's your birthday, lots of people come to your home and gives you gifts, right? And as a present. So G gift. So let's revise all these words once again. G grapes. G grass. G glass. G girl. G goggle. And G gift. Even we have G for goat, right? So we ha you have to all revise these names, right? Now we are switching over to the next phonic sound that is called ha, 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 ha for hammer. This is a new word for you, hammer. Okay, hammer. This is ha for hut, hut. Ha for hat, ha for hat, ha for hat. Okay. How for hand? This is your hand, right? These are the fingers, and this is your entire hand. This is hand. So all these words start from her sound. Let's revise once again. Hammer, hammer, hut, hut. Can you can you feel the sound which is coming out from my mouth? Huh, huh, hut, hat, and hand. Now it's time how to write this. So let's learn all together. So first of all, we'll write G. For writing G, again, we have to write in four lines, right? We have to use four line copies. For that writing of G, we have to use second, third and fourth line. Remember, second, third and fourth line, we have to write in, in between these. The topmost line, we are, going, we are not going to use that. So for writing ga, again one slanting line. You have a you have to make a shape of nine slanting nine, okay? Then from here, the slanting, the curve goes up. Okay, this is called ga. Once again, just let's check it out. This is ga. Okay. Now for writing her, we have to use first topmost line, second line, and third line. So we will be starting from the third line itself. Third line will go from third line will go to the topmost line, like this. Okay. Then we'll take a curve and come back to the same line from where we had started. We'll stop here and we'll pick the second line and we'll write her like this. Okay. Let's revise once again. Let's write once again. Her. So this is these are the formation for writing correct formation of writing g and h. So children, I hope you will revise these two sounds today at home, and you will draw these pictures at home, which are starting from sound g and h. Like you can draw easily grapes, grass, glass, goggle, and girl and gift. These are very simple drawings. You can. Draw it under your parents' supervision, and the same way on another page, you can draw hurt very simple hand, 
hat and hut. Hammer will be a little difficult for you, so ask your parent to draw it first for you. Then you can color it on the, all on the uh, pictures, given pictures, right? This is your classwork. This is your practice work, which you'll have to do. And the another page, on the another page, you have to write these two sounds all together. Okay? So, this is for today. See you next day. Till then, take care and bye-bye.